the fuck going on with y'all man welcome back to another episode of one piece so last episode it's still going down we got the cage match initiated inside Zoro took down I think the last priest with his new new move okay it went from 36 pounds to 108 so in the moment Zoro somehow tripled his new attack that he just learned you know in 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 a, in a moment of life or death which is really how you level up especially in anime okay so cool right Zoro, uh Nami and Luffy and Aisa and Gonfall still stuck in the snake they'll find their way out Usopp and Sanji still burnt to a crisp they're probably out out of the whole fight for the rest of this arc to be honest they took I mean not only did, did they take lightning to their whole body you know what I'm saying all their nerves and shit but they didn't see it coming right and that's like double the damage because when you don't see like a punch coming it's gonna knock your ass out you know what I mean so so yeah they're probably out of commission this whole arc unfortunate it is what it is but I feel like Luffy Zoro and the Shandians can all hold it down against Ineru. Maybe. We just, it, it really boils down to we have to find a way to land ahead on this motherfucker. It's like, it's kind of the same problem as the, as the Alabasta arc, except this time, I can't really, I really can't see it. You know, water, sand makes sense, but lightning? How the fuck we gonna hit lightning? I don't know. But I'm, again, Luffy figure it out. Wiper is doing his thing. Shandians trying to do their thing, right? It, it it just comes down to, I mean, Aneru is just doing whatever he wants. He's teleporting everywhere, shocking people, killing people with a huge smile on his face. You know what I'm saying? He's doing whatever the fuck he wants. So someone needs to check his ass. And that someone's probably going to be Luffy. How is he going to do it? I have no idea, but I expect that to happen. Okay. Anyway. That's where we are in the story. So without further ado, let's get into it. This is One Piece episode 179. Uh, if you are not a member of the channel, members get early access to these One Piece reactions. And I'm at least like 50 episodes ahead or something crazy like that. So if you want to be able to watch those One Piece episodes, click that join button down below to become a member, okay? And of course, if you want to watch the full versions instead, you can head over to my Patreon, which is linked down below in the description. On that Patreon, you can find the full version of all the One Piece reactions so far. And of course, so many other TV shows and animes. There's literally thousands of hours of content on that patreon so for five bucks you will definitely be getting your money's worth i promise you all right other than that op 179 let's go oh yeah her dad died i forgot shit i feel like he didn't have to but i get it you know you kind of always need a sacrificial play in every arc you know what I'm saying? For that that emotion. I understand. Damn. He doesn't have to die though. <laughs> That's a GG. Zoro got him. Zoro's might be progressing faster than Luffy, but then again, we haven't seen Luffy's level up this arc, right? So we gotta wait for that. But Zoro kind of level up twice. New, new move. Jihida, <laughs> Damn, he can really do that from anywhere? He just goes like this and then fucking smite someone from a million miles away? <laughs> Fuck that. <laughs> Maybe the best matchup for him is Nami. Nami is probably the only one that understands how to defeat this dude. That would be dope, actually. What the hell is he doing? Oh my, oh my god. The 
he just did he just destroy the battlefield just like that is all of them dead <laughs> what the fuck oh he's dropping everyone down oh so they're gonna fight in the original shandora yo that's kind of dope fight where it all began okay <laughs> oh Nice. Bro, that is a high drop. How, if they live after this, that's kind of wild. That's a far drop down. God, higher than any roller coaster I've ever seen. My goodness. Oh my god. <laughs> Jesus. Bro. How, <laughs> how, so obviously they're gonna, they're all going to live after this fall, but I I hope I just hope it makes sense. Just a little bit, you know what I'm saying? Cuz literally you should die off falling this this much. <laughs> Okay. Zoro's alive. That makes sense though. He's he's an actual he's made of fucking steel. Him him living after a fall like that. That makes sense. I could take that. <laughs> is that really the only way it doesn't have a snout like a like a whale i mean as silly as luffy is he might have a point that might be the only way out shandra <laughs> They're home. See, now they might get a buff. They might get that origin buff. The original Shandora, they're here. Oh no. What the fuck? Why? Why? Bro. Is he, is he okay? Couldn't he have tamed that snake to fight alongside him? That snake was doing its thing back at the Royal Rumble. What the fuck? He just... God, man. This guy has no restraint. Mm. Well, Wiper, here's your match, bro. This is what he wanted. He wanted to fight an arrow 1v1. Let's see what he's got. I hope he has more than that reject dial. That's not gonna do it. Oh, so he thinks... Oh, shit. Oh shit. Nami, why'd you. He's almost right, though. There are almost five people, but then Luffy and Isa are in there. Can he not see within the snake? Has he not sensed Luffy this whole time? Ooh, that could be. That could be the change. That could be what does it. Yeah, I love that. I like that. Mm -hmm. Don't be afraid of this bitch, even though he's probably going to own us. <laughs> nice. Good answer. 
if there's gonna be five left, then you you're gonna be one of the, you're not gonna be one of the five, bitch. That's what that's basically what they said. Okay, well we're finally here. We're finally looking an arrow in his eye. We're finally in arm's distance, you know. Even seeing his power, the groups, the crew is still not afraid. That's good. Because if I was there, I'd be terrified. This dude, <laughs> he's made of lightning, man. Like, what the fuck do you do? He's made of lightning. He can't do anything. Um, yeah, it's tough. It's tough. But there is a saving grace here. Maybe Luffy being inside the snake was a blessing in disguise, literally. Because he, he obviously senses Nami over there. And that's who he was talking about to remove from the battlefield to make it exactly five people that were, you know, awake and ready to fight. Luffy and Isa are stuck inside the snake. So if his mantra for some reason can't get past those those snake scales and he hasn't sensed Luffy this whole time, that could be the game changer, right? And um Yeah. That could be the game changer. Now I still don't know how Luffy's gonna be able to handle him. I don't know. <laughs> Wait. I think I just figured it out. Wait. Sixth grade science just popped up in my head. Can you electrify rubber? You can't, right? Wait, that makes sense. Oh, shit. Wait, is Luffy the counter? <laughs> hold on, hold on, hold on. Is Luffy the only counter to this dude? If my memory from fucking middle school serves me right, you can't electrify rubber. Which means Luffy might be the only person in the whole world that can handle this guy. Because Luffy won't be affected by his electricity, right? Unless his lightning is that strong. Then I'm just st st speaking out of my ass here, but... You know, if we're talking about counters, Luffy is the counter. Now, that, that, that doesn't explain how Luffy is going to land a hit on him. But it, it does explain that if what I say is correct, an arrow won't be able to damage Luffy at all. Right? Oh. Well, then, damn. There it is. <laughs> I was over here trying to think hella hard when the answer was kind of in front of my face you know and it helped knowing that luffy is inside the snake and a and Nehru doesn't sense him you know so it's like a surprise right and it made me think like okay then luffy might must be the difference in the fight if they're keeping him hidden you know and that's when the the the, uh, the rubber counter to electricity popped up in my head because if luffy's the chains and that would make a lot of sense Oh, all right. Well, if I'm right, then say I'm right. If I'm not, then don't tell me the right answer because I want to figure it out myself. All right. <laughs> but I think that's it. That, that that makes a lot of sense in my head. You know, when, when the whole water alabasta thing came about, I was like, oh, that makes sense. And I get the same feeling about Luffy and electricity. So <laughs> hopefully that's correct. But then again, lightning, I mean, electricity is one thing. Lightning is another. I feel like lightning is like 100 times stronger. But still, it shouldn't affect rubber, right? Maybe. Hey, anyway, we'll fucking see. We are 10-ish episodes left in this arc. And what I say sounds right. So we'll see, baby. Anyway, that's going to be it for the reaction, y'all. If y'all enjoyed it, or if you guys like my theories, like, comment, subscribe, hit the bell, algorithm shit, you know what I'm saying? And of course, join the Discord if you haven't already. Uh, if you're not a member of the YouTube, members get early access to these One Piece reactions. And I'm at least like 50 episodes ahead 
or something crazy like that so if you want to be able to watch those click that join button down below all right and of course if you want to watch the full versions instead you can head over to my patreon which is linked down below in the description on that patreon you can find the full version of all the one piece episodes so far and so many other tv shows and animes there's literally thousands of hours of content on that patreon so for five bucks you will definitely be getting your money's worth i promise you all right other than that i'm out of here y'all have a good one and i'll see you on the next episode of one piece all right peace